In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to turn your phasmophobia graphics from this into this. This tutorial is going to be super simple and easy. Now, I know there are a few of you guys who don't like doing these kind of things to your game's graphics, which is totally fine. But for the majority, I hope, that love doing these kind of things, like myself, then I would suggest hitting the subscribe button down below because I will be making more videos like this in the future. Anyways, let's get into the video. Okay, first things first is you'll want to head to Google and search for Reshade and download the application. Once that's finished, click into it and select your Phasmophobia game. And then hit select application down below. Next thing you want to do is essentially select all of the presets that come with Reshade. Except for the 3D one. I've never tried that one. I don't want to. You can if you want, but I wouldn't suggest it. Once that's done, you'll want to go to the bottom of each of them because it'll have you go through each of them and hit OK on every one of them. Once that's done, you can close Reshade and you can go right into Phasmophobia. One quick way to tell that the Reshade is working is that the top left, which would be above me, <laughs> um, should have like a menu essentially telling you that the reshade is working. Okay, so now you're in the Phasmophobia game. What do you do next? So you'll want to hit the home button, which is somewhere on your keyboard. I'll show a little video right now. This, that's where the key is. Um, once you click that, it'll open the reshade menu. If it doesn't, then go through the process again. If it does, good, reshade's working. Now you can customize to your heart's content, do whatever you want. But now you might be asking, where do I start? You know, there's so many selections, so many things to do. Well, that's why I'm here. In the description below, I've got a link to a reshade preset that I made myself in fact, it's the one that you saw at the beginning of the video. Once you download this link, you want to go to this file location in your file explorer. I have my phone on me to tell you because it's long. Um. <laughs> so first things first, you want to go into your file explorer and click on the drive that your Phasmophobia game is in. Next, go to Program Files, the times 86 one, then Steam, then Steam Apps, then common, and then your phasmophobia game. Now this is where you want to put the file that you downloaded. Obviously it won't let me since I've already got one in there, but once you got yours in there, then you can close out the file explorer and go right into phasmophobia. Okay, so now you're back into phasmophobia. Now you want to click the home button on your keyboard so you can open the reshade menu. Once you do that, then you can hit the preset bar. Okay, so once you do that, then click the super duper preset, which should be on there, and you'll see your game transform. Now, I will be showing a few clips near the end of the video, so if you wanna see that, stick around. But other than that, I mean, that's it for me, guys. Uh, if you want to see more videos like this in the future, feel free to hit that subscribe button. It's free. You can always unsubscribe. But other than that, see you later.